reign in hell than serve in heaven. Is that it? Why not? I'm here on the ground with my nose in it since the whole thing began. I've nurtured every sensation man has been inspired to have. I cared about what he wanted, and I never judged him. Why? Because I never rejected him. In spite of all his imperfections, I'm a fan of man. I'm a humanist. Maybe the last humanist. Who in their right mind, Kevin, could possibly deny the 20th century was entirely mine? All of it, Kevin! All of it. Mine. I'm peeking. It's my time now. It's hey, YouTube. How you guys doing this morning? I just wanted to show a few videos about all this uh, predictive programming with the, uh, the asteroids. They're always having movies with asteroids hitting the Earth. And I just want to show you what uh, what I believe the Bible says about it. But you guys check this out real quick. I don't see Clark. Uh, maybe he's still sleeping. Dad. <laughs> Some of Clark's larger fragments are now expected to enter our atmosphere. That's right. I know that you're just... What are they saying? It's more of the same. I it's going to make a heck of a show. They've been saying this stuff for years. First chunk is about to hit. Hit? Only part of it. It's going in the ocean. But you look at that. Wait, what is the explosion? We now are getting word that the fragment has hit Central Florida. Oh my God. Wait, are some more pieces going to hit? Come on, let's go. But the sky's on fire. Two days. They got it all wrong. There's a ton of fragments. Planet killers. Space agencies are predicting an extinction level events. We're going to be together, all right, kiddo? We're just trying to get to safety. They've been tracking the military flights to bunkers in Greenland. It's our only chance. Check this out. This is what I really think this is. If you look uh, back in Revelation, let's see. Revelation 12, and his tail drew a third part of the stars of heaven and did cast them to the earth. And the dragon stood before the woman which was ready to be delivered to devour her child as soon as it was born. And the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. And he was cast out into the earth and his angels were cast out with him. 33%, you know, your whole third, the whole 33. I'm going to show you some videos where you, everybody already knows they talk about 33 all the time. But they're going to have to have a big lie because the devil and a third of the angels, the 33%, are going to be cast to this earth. And they're going to be saying that it's asteroids. It's like this movie. I'm going to play the rest of this uh, preview. You know, I don't know if all 33% are going to hit at the same time or if it's going to be an event that takes a while, but I don't I don't plan on being here because, you know, the child, the church is called up to God. You know, I believe at the same time that the devil and his angels are cast down to this earth. So I don't know if it's going to be a where they all fall at the same time or probably an event like they're showing in some of these movies right here. Hearing this broadcast, seek shelter immediately. What is it? What's going on? If you are hearing this broadcast, seek shelter John, immediately. Go. Seek shelter immediately. Seek shelter immediately. Russia.
Russian President Vladimir Putin showed off what he said. Okay, here's a couple more previews. Our movie. Check this out. Let's see. Just all in your face. If you look at the headlines, especially if you listen to a lot of the fake pastors like Bagley, every other video they do is an asteroid is going to narrowly miss the Earth. I mean, I can't tell you how many times they said that we're going to be nearly missed by asteroids. It's crazy. See, I believe these asteroids, though, they're, they're, uh, they're not, uh, excuse me, the fallen stars, these fallen uh, angels, they're going to fall into people and leaders. That's why I believe the Freemasons have the whole world mapped out with everything's numbered, everything's put, lined up with the, exactly the way the stars are. Look, look at the way Washington, D.C. is lined up. I mean, they line all this stuff up with their gods, you know, the stars and the planets. You know, they worship like Saturn, they worship Jupiter, they worship Venus. And it's just crazy. Just uh, right in your face all the time. Here's another one I'll show you guys. This is pretty crazy too. 2020 end of days. They know this event's coming. I mean, they've been showing us this stuff for years. See, this one even says 2020. There it is. There, there it is. This, this tornado just touched down. Well, we can see it from right here. It's ripping up trees. It's ripping up everything in its sight. If you're above ground, you need to get to a storm shelter or a safe place right now. Never even seen this movie. Wow, that's crazy. Check this out.
Revelation 12, 12. Therefore rejoice, ye heavens, and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth he hath but a short time. When, he, when they get cast down here, that's when he's going to have the great wrath, and he's going to... Right here, and the serpent cast out of his mouth water as a flood after the woman, that he might cause her to be carried away of the flood. That's what you just saw right there. And then you even goes on where it says, and there followed another angel saying, Babylon is fallen, is fallen. That great city, because she made all nations drink of the wine of the wrath of her fornication. Let's see if I forgot any. That right here, First Thessalonians 5, 3. This is, uh, I believe, the time we're living in. I mean, you hear Trump and everybody saying peace and safety. Uh, there's actually a couple videos, uh, I don't have them pulled up, where he actually says peace and safety now. They used to say peace and security, but it says, For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. But I just want to show you guys... Uh, couple more short clips I'll show you atheism is mine just put a good clip together the dragon cast a third of the stars to earth Fallen angels come to earth. This stuff is all in your face. Yesterday we had 22 cases, today we have 33 cases, so it's gone up by 11. Uh, uh, that brings, those are 11 new cases, uh, 22 goes to 33. As we sort through this here uh, in Arkansas, uh, today uh, I, we have 33 confirmed positive cases in Arkansas. Uh, as of today, we have 33 confirmed cases uh, with Boston residents. We expect those numbers to climb. As of th this afternoon, we have 33 Pennsylvanians who have tested positive for COVID-19. See, guys, this is all about the third of the angels. Revelation 12, the devil gets cast out of heaven and his tail casts a third of the stars to the earth. Unbelievable. Um, so as of this morning, there were 33 confirmed uh, cases in North Carolina. Good evening to you. Lots to get to tonight. I'm Leon Hendricks. We want to start with new information into our newsroom. Within the past couple of hours, there are now 33 confirmed cases of the coronavirus in Michigan. Good evening, everyone. Thanks. For yeah, also, uh, when the first horse of the apocalypse, the white horse rider, he's given a crown, a corona, and goes out to conquer. I mean, this stuff is, is, it's coming. I mean, they're showing us it's its right at the door. Right at the door. Thanks for joining us for the news at 6. I'm Richard Gearhart. Karina Corral has the night off. More cases of the coronavirus were confirmed today in San Luis Obispo County, bringing the total number now to 33. Right now, Georgia is reporting a total of 99 cases in 19 counties. That is 33 new cases. 33. Just yesterday. Good afternoon. I'm Karen Swenson. More cases and more events affected. Here is the latest coronavirus news. There are now 33 cases in Louisiana. As expected. As expected. The number As of cases expected. of COVID-19 jumps. A total of 33 people in our state wow. have been tested and are confirmed to have the coronavirus. Day four of the shelter at home order brought six new confirmed cases of the coronavirus to San Luis Obispo County, bringing the total number to 33. 
All troopers will be professional, polite, and will treat everyone with dignity and respect. These latest steps as the number of confirmed COVID-19 cases in Rhode Island jumps by 33 overnight. Four more deaths reported overnight. The death toll now stands at 33. 33. 33. The Ministry of Public Health has confirmed a batch of 33 new COVID-19 patients. Maya now has an accumulated number of cases. Telangana lo coronavirus virus na padi vari sankhya mumbai mundi meri. Nenna kotha ga aru kesu na mada yai. Indu lo vakaru karim nagar ko chendra irame mude na vichar. Wow. As and his tail drew a third part of the stars of heaven and did cast them to the earth. 33. That's it right there. It's it's coming. You know, in my opinion, uh it's going to set up perfect. Uh you know, Independence Day is coming July 4th and 5th and it's going to line up. There's going to be a full moon. Uh, July 5th uh, at 4.44 in the morning. There's going to be a full moon. And uh, it's... When they bring the second wave on, especially if the rapture happens right then, you know, the whole Independence movie came out and the asteroids following the aliens. I mean, it's... I'm telling you right now, it says, They shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction come up with them as travail upon a woman with a child and they shall not escape but you know we need to keep looking up for our redemption draweth nigh you know one more thing Let's see if I can find this real quick sorry I didn't have this pulled up Tell me that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and shall believe in thy heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. For with the heart a man believeth unto righteousness, and with his mouth confession is made until salvation. So what we're doing, guys, right here, because uh, thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. You know, we're praying always that we're worthy to escape all the things that are coming upon this earth so that we shall stand in front of the Son of Man. Anyway, guys, hope you guys have a blessed day. Take care.
Are you are you serious? Seriously? Are you serious? Are you serious? Can I have some more coffee? One day, Jesus is coming. You may be at church. You may be at work. You may be asleep. God grant that you will be ready when he makes his personal appearance. My God, what if his appearance occurs on a Sunday morning? My prophetic word to you this morning is get ready, get ready!